Alright, how's it going everybody? I'm back with some more Ellen Ginter. Uh, today I'm just doing one box, and as a bonus, I've got three packs here. This is from another box that I opened earlier, and these are also the three packs that have the hits from that box, that's why I've saved them. Uh, if you watched the other video, I pointed out that uh, every box I opened, all the hits were in the exact same place, and uh, that's looking true for this box that I opened earlier. So this box that I'm opening right now, this is the sixth box that I've opened, so I'm halfway through the case that I bought this week. And uh, the reason I picked this box was it seemed a little bit bulkier, and I thought well, maybe there's something in there that's causing that, or it could just be that the uh, packs were all messed up in transit, which looks like it might be the case, as some of these not where they should have been. So there's 24 packs. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And in every box, the second pack in each stack has had the hit. So I'm going to reserve that for later. And I'm going to do the same here. And who knows, maybe it'll be different for once, but... Um, it's a bit unusual for the hits to always be in the same spot, but Topps has had some production issues recently. Even had some production issues with these cards, with the, some of the cards that were supposed to be in the set weren't printed. Uh, so, let's see here. All right. so we're going to start with the box topper. Yadier Melina, box topper. So I'm still working on my set. I still don't have a, a full set, but uh, I'm hoping that uh, I'll finish the set pretty soon. I'm not too far away. Uh, I still need about 15 or so of the short prints. So Citadels and Safe Holds. This is one of the uh, mini inserts that are one in every 50 packs. So you only get one of those every two boxes. So and I, and about, I don't know, probably 60 cards short of the uh, 300 normal cards in the set. And I see a few new ones in there, I think. It's an Andy Cohen mini. It's an A and G. A One World Trade Center. A digging Deep insert. Johnny Bench. The Closet Where Monsters Live. Pretty close to completing that, too. Johnson, Cepeda, Dansby Swanson, A and G back. I've noticed I've been getting a lot more of the A and G backs than I think I should be getting, at least based on the odds. So the A and G, A and G back is supposed to be one in five, I guess. That's actually a little bit more frequent than I was thinking they were. Yeah, definitely haven't seen some of these before, so that's a good sign. Bugging Out is another one of the uh, inserts that's one every 50 packs. Barn. Yeah, I'm really liking this box so far, at least in terms of the base cards. And I still don't have a, uh, a rip card through five boxes, well, four boxes, since I haven't opened those hits from that fifth box yet. Show you the bottom. Baseball Brent Mini. It's the regular one. Another long ball lore. Mark 
Mariano Boggs, Suarez, Mini, and the Yadier Molina Field Generals. Nolan Ryan. That's Hiro Tanaka, and that's the Nate NG back. A debut to remember, Otani. A win. I was actually at that game. His uh, his pitching debut in 2018 in Oakland. Looks really good. I think he struck out like seven or eight guys. Had a little trouble in the first, but that was it. He was pretty dominant after that. So Tucker Black Border. And the Wilshire Grand Center. Rookie Betts. Guerrero Senior. And a pig for the farm. I think the only farm one that I'm missing is a chicken. And that's the only one that I haven't seen yet. Daryl Strawberry. If you watched the first video, you know that I got a Daryl Strawberry book card. One of two autographs I've gotten so far in this case. So hopefully one of these six packs that I'm saving for the end. Oh, got something here. It's just the uh, crack the code card. For some reason, it's a little glossy. Yeah. Sean Casey, it's a short print mini, and Jason Veritek. Paul Molitor, <clears throat> Vigio. Schwarber. And Strasburg. Aaron Judge. Pedro. And Ozuna. Regular mini. Gold. Black Border Mini, Willis Tower, Don Mattingly, Aparicio, it's a, a Short Print Mini, and a Silo, still no chicken. Banks, Chipper, or Kitty, Rookie, a debut to remember for Griffey Jr. Loriano, Jim Abbott, Reggie, a Pedro Mini, ANG. And a ruby. Alright, this is the last of the non-hit packs. A Soto. Mini. And a Sandy Alomar Jr. Alright, so here's... Our final six packs, all of these should have a hit.
McKay rookie, Tatis Jr. McKay rookie, Teft, and, <laughs> and an R.L. Stein relic card. A lot of these uh, relic cards are the, uh, the non baseball cards. So, we've got a Steve Byrne relic. And now an R.L. Stein relic. Alright, so that's hit number one. Alright, hit number two. R.L. Stein regular card. And there is our rip card. Juan Soto rip card. 77 of 99. Then we got a Buster Posey mini card. So this looks like it's only a single rip card, so it's only got one card inside. So these cards can have a, a red mini autograph card or an exclusive parallel. Or an exclusive mini wood parallel or an exclusive mini metal parallel. And I'm still not sure I want to open it or not. Let me, uh, I'm going to think about it for, uh, for a minute here. Right. So this is the, um, the last pack from that uh, earlier box that I opened. And here we have uh, Marcus Stroman. Relic, Kirby Yates Mini, alright, so this is uh, the box I just opened, I think, alright, Kim, Larkin, Scherzer, Polanco, and a Trevor Story, uh, looks like a, yeah, that's a Bat Relic there. Second hit, and looks like it's going to be a mini, either a relic or a autograph. Koufax, Harper. Let's get rid of the Tanzanite and Johnny Bench. All right. So, do we have a relic or an auto? Autograph. For that football player that I'm not familiar with, J.K. Dobbins. So I don't know if he's any good. I guess I'll find out after this. But so that's my third autograph in six boxes, which is a pretty good rate because I think there's only autographs in every three boxes or so. So I'm a little bit ahead of where I should be with autos. Hopefully that doesn't mean like I only have one more to go in the case. Got another mini either relic or auto. I, I imagine it's gotta be a it's gotta be a, a a relic. I can't imagine there being two autos in the same box. And yeah, it looks like it was a relic, yeah. For Jeff Bagwell. That's a pretty good relic. Alright, so I've got two minis and the rip card and three relics. I really want to rip it, but I kind of want to wait and see if I can find the second rip card in this case and I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna, I'm gonna wait to get the second rip card and then I will 100% rip one of those two and then I will keep the other but uh, I want to see what the other one is first before I uh, before I rip it but still pretty cool finally got a rip card 
and uh, another autograph. So, uh, more fun with Alan and Ginter, and I hope you enjoyed. See you next time.